All right, Friday night, it's a great time to maybe look up to the sky. We could see something really spectacular out there, a solar show. What's going on, John? Hey, Melissa, the Northern Lights, you often think about Iceland or one of the Scandinavian countries, but not so much Ohio and Michigan. There is a strong geomagnetic storm that will allow the Northern Lights to be visible for many Michiganders and some Ohioans. Now, the KP index of eight, that is on a scale of zero to nine, and that represents some fairly strong activity that will allow the Northern Lights to be visible for parts of the Great Lakes region. Now, the best viewing conditions are going to be to the north of us, but there still is a chance to see for some Ohioans. Now, there is going to be cloud cover increasing late this evening. However, especially southeast of Toledo, the clear skies will enable you to see those northern lights on the horizon. The bigger the KP index, the further south it is visible, and that is why the strength of the geomagnetic storm is so critical. It's going to start to ramp up this evening, but the best viewing conditions happen overnight, and what we call a severe geomagnetic storm will allow some good viewing conditions. Now, is it going to light up the entire night sky? Not necessarily. It It'll be a little more muted on the horizon, but it's still worth a look, especially later on in the evening. We do expect clear skies early on, but there is going to be a little wing of cloud cover that comes in by 11 p.m. south and east of the Toledo Metro. I've gotten questions about viewing over Maumee Bay and Lake Erie. That is going to be the prime spot south and east. However, those clouds are going to become thicker overnight tonight as we see a round of rain showers move in by daybreak Saturday. 